Ron Time Rap Gang, Sucker Bang Bang Bang, man. I'm back, man. We are Sunday Morning Massacre 8. Let me first start off by saying, you know, thank you for all the supporters, man, that hit the boys to let me know this thing worth doing. Um, I, I kind of paused for a couple Sundays just to see what was going to happen. Then I dropped the Wednesday. You know, I dropped the Wednesday Bible study. That was like the, the number seven mask And, and y'all let me know y'all was listening and responding and say it's time for eight. And, you know, I toil with it, man, to be honest. Because, you know, I'm out here. I'm taking Bible verses. I'm taking past experiences. And, and I'm giving them to you in, in a story form. And, uh, you know, sometimes, man, inspiration is, 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 is a wild thing. It's a little difficult to find. So, you know, I took the story of Samson. And I got inspired to say, well, what brings a woman to the point where she becomes a Delilah? Well, Money matters more than love and stability and you know what I mean? It made me think about like when I was 15 the girl broke my heart man I, You know she was my little Bo Jackson mom. I bought a matching Bo Jackson's we had to match the starters and, and a nigga who was 22 with a car took her from me. I was 15 I couldn't afford no car man and It made me think you know at that point in my life That's when I learned that you know it's some things that's stronger than you know love puppy love you know, the good love, the bad love, and, and that's the love of money and the love of wealth. And a lot of times when we're giving women, you know, money in exchange for their bodies, be it sex or be it stripping or things like that, what we're really doing is devaluing them. You know, the thousands we get them ain't really worth what they worth. And then when they get on that shit like I'm about that money, the purse, the cause, you know, we be the first to say, oh, she a money hungry, oh, she a... But nah, man, we did that, so, you know... I got to tell you, this Sunday morning massacre was, was inspired by Delilah, man. You know, at the end of the story in the Bible, she just disappeared. You never know what happened to her. You know, and I, I like to feel like, you know, Delilah's still out here like, this shit was inspired by Korean Stevens, man. <laughs> you know, straight up, man. Every time I see that motherfucker, I like it. And I know how many lives she done fucked up. And that's why I never want to meet her. So, you know, I think, you know, whether you're Elliot Spitzer, you know, whether you're a potential presidential candidate, you know what I'm saying, like my man who got knocked off, um, when they found out he had an affair or whatever after he had dropped out of the race, like, whether you're Bill Clinton, whether you're a president, a man's greatest Achilles heel will, was, and always will be whores. This is dedicated to the Lila man and all. Uh, Corinne, I love you. I just never want to meet you. It's the grind. Grind time rap game. I hope y'all uh, um, I hope y'all enjoy the story of Delilah. It's not usual, you know what I mean, the hard trying to take you to a dark place. It feel like you feel when you be having a good time with all. Oh, it's fun. Have a little fun, man. Sunday morning massacre. Support live struggle. I'm sitting there waiting for this motherfucker to open. Yeah, we do it like that on Sunday. I'll let you boys the grind. Cheap.